Hi, this is Martin Grumman with Progressive News, September 1st, Sunday, 2019. And I just want to elaborate on uh, what Kyle has to say here because he misses a few points. Associated with the pro with the product as a result of it being on the black market. Why? Because gangsters and criminals have a monopoly. Okay, so he's going to point out a whole lot of good points, you know, and this is it if you want to watch it. And it'll be in my playlist today. So, uh, okay, what Kyle missed when he was talking about this, he covered almost most of the, the good points for legalization, but if you legalize it, then, well, the stigma goes away, right? Kind of like, remember when you were a kid and they said, well, if you tell somebody they can't do it, then they want to do it all the more. But, uh, it doesn't get, uh, like you can't go to the doctor if you feel like you're abusing the substance. Uh, you can't uh, fight the addiction effectively because it's illegal and you're afraid you'll get thrown in jail by talking to anybody about it. Uh, and that, that goes for all the drugs, right? But here's the, the most important point to me. And that's the the drug can't be developed. So whether it's heroin or, uh, you know, whatever, Percodan, all the different drugs, right? Which is heroin, I guess. But you can't, uh, it doesn't get developed. So the, it becomes like uh, more usable, you know, so the... Uh, it gets improved in ways that make it less addictive and uh, uh, ways that uh, counteract the harmful side effects of using the drugs. You know, half of the, uh, the people you see who get all fucked up on drugs a lot of it is because they're using the drug in a certain uh, form, you know. So what I'm saying is, is the whole scientific community gets behind developing the drug. And, you know, eventually it just becomes uh, not nearly so harmful. So he missed that. I just wanted to point it out.